Before I came in here, I have epilepsy and I had a seizure and fell down the stairs, knocked my teeth out. Within time, because I have 11 children and they come first and they all needed braces, you know, I kind of went on the side, but eventually I needed some work done and, and really was grateful for the different plans, the options to be able to afford getting this done. And not only that, but you guys have such great affordable options, but are not, the price for them is not higher than, you know, if you do your research, it's not extraordinarily higher than anywhere else, but it's so much more convenient. And again, the, the work when the finished product is hands down, you know the difference between different offices. So it's, it's amazing. It's so traumatic when you lose your teeth. It, to me anyways, it was like losing an arm. Like it was huge. My, I could function normally and it, looking in, at myself in the mirror was scary and it was very detrimental. So once I had my teeth back, what do I look forward to? Everything. <laughs> I look forward to eating and smiling and playing and tickling, laughing, having fun with my babies and my husband. You know, that's all I want. And I'm really blessed to have that. The reaction of my friends and family has been astounding. It's, it's day and night. It's not only what it looks like, but how I speak if I'm able to eat. And it's really sad knowing that dental insurance isn't more covered through our health plan because people need it, not only just for the, the looks, but just to be able to be a human being and be able to function. It's been wonderful and, and they've all thought I looked amazing. So lucky me. <laughs> just an added bonus. You look amazing. Thank 100%. you so much. That's to you guys. <laughs> Thank you. How do you feel your confidence and everything has changed since having this procedure done? I feel my confidence is a lot higher, especially speaking because that was very difficult beforehand. I can actually articulate what I want to say. What has been something that you finally are able to eat again that you've been waiting to eat for so Oh long? my god, uh, peanuts. Like, and all uh, the things that I love to eat that I couldn't eat before was nuts. And like, I just, I love peanuts and almonds, even like cabbage, I couldn't eat that. Like, I feel like I have so many more options and to actually have a healthier life in that way as well, makes a huge difference. When I went through this process, one of the things I was very scared about, that was the sedation part of it and being able to be sedated and comfortable. I also had a lot of nerve issues, so I was afraid I wouldn't be able to get numb, but the anesthesiologist was amazing. I was calm, as calm as I could be. And you know, I, I walked in and I, I was trying to be a champ, but <laughs> she was amazing. Um, talked me through everything. Dr. Rich did, all of um, you, you assistants were amazingly supportive and knowledgeable and really got me through it and even brought a blanket so I was comfortable. And this place is pristine, but even it, it wasn't just what I was watching, which you guys would offer different shows, different movies, but also do I want to hear music? Do I want headphones? Do I want sunglasses? Do I need a blanket? It's all about my comfort and it was amazing. Every time I come in, I'm greeted with a smile and a sweet word. It's very comforting. I used to be an oral surgeon, dental assistant for 11 years and I knew exactly what I wanted doing the research, but it is so rare and so hard to find somebody that not only can do it, which is just rare alone, but to master the technique because it's really artwork. He's just amazing. Everybody who comes in here is so kind and nice and well informed. Anytime I have a question, everyone, everybody knows the answer. You know, one to another to another. Everyone has great communication between each other and it's, it's really nice. So I know you've kind of gone through the whole process and everything. So now what does your follow up look like with Dr. Rich? Well, my follow up process with Dr. Rich would be coming, I believe every two years. If there's ever an issue, he quickly has me come in. Usually there's no issue. There's been a teeny little here and there since everything was done, but it was so quickly done and so like efficient that I was surprised that it only took a couple more visits afterwards for it to be perfect. And so it's really been great. And it's um, not a lot of upkeep, which is great too. It makes life a whole lot easier <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Definitely. Yes, yeah, you can't get rid of us. You can visit us. Every Good, you did, because I will. <laughs> You're stuck with us. <laughs> You're stuck with me. Perfect. It works well. <laughs> it does. What's something that you're really looking forward to doing now that you 
got your new smile. Now that I have my new smile, um, I look forward to family pictures. I always had it just with the children, but now I can smile and feel proud and happy and more than anything, just feel like mom, like me, just human, just back. Being a mother of 11 children and putting myself on the side for a long time, and I, I know that your children always come first, but you know, as they say, if an airplane goes down, you put the mask over you first. If you're not a happy parent because you don't feel confident or you can't speak the way you want to or eat the way, the, the way you feel you need to eat to have a healthy life, you're leading by example and your children see you. And if you're not confident, they're gonna, you know, they're gonna be self-conscious. I think as a mom, I don't want them to grow up and feel that way and feel like, oh, well, you know, mom was worried about this and this. And sometimes something like your teeth is so important for your mental health, for your physical body, for your uh, confidence. It's, it's everything. 